Nigerian Air Force is constitutionally established to project air power. Projection of air power is only possible when there are adequately trained pilots and support personnel. Consequently, the present administration in the Nigerian Air Force deliberately focus on human capacity development of our personnel in order to bestow to the NAV a cream of well-trained personnel that meet international standards. Some of the products of our deliberate policy are the young men seated on the other side of the hall that are here today to be decorated with their new wings. We are committed to repositioning the Nigerian Air Force and placing it on a glorious path. To this effect, we will continue to ensure that the Nigerian Air Force personnel are well trained to carry out their constitutional duties. So far, the Nigerian Air Force has done creditably well in discharging its constitutional responsibilities in various areas of conflict, from Operation Lafia Dole in the Northeast, Operation Delta Safe in the South South, Sharandaji in the Northwest, and part of North Central, to Operation Awase in the Southwest, and Operation Safe Haven in Plateau State. The crop of pilots, among other personnel, undertaking daring missions day and night in the midst of real danger are testimonies of the quality of training we are providing to our personnel in the service. This morning, in realization of our drive for human capacity development through robust and result-oriented training for enhanced professional performance, I am highly delighted to be winging another set of pilots that have conducted, having completed their training in South Africa. I feel very honored, and on behalf of Westline Aviation, we have to thank you. I've got to say that we know that at the heart of the military is discipline. So I've noticed in the 10 young men under the leadership of Flying Officer Allo, that discipline, absolute discipline at heart. The event of today is another eloquent testimony of this progressive inclination. It is most encouraging that the dividends of your investments have not been long in coming. We cannot but credit your invaluable role in the maintenance of national security and stability. The accomplishment of adding this new and special category of manpower to the stock of your human resource comes with reassuring significance, especially within the context of all of your operationally hindering factors. I avail myself this opportunity to acknowledge the unrelenting efforts of the Chief of Air Staff to develop a vibrant and professional Air Force. The footprints are indelible in all the critical sectors. Um, it's, it's, it's really an overwhelming moment for me and I'm really very happy. And I'm, very, I'm very proud of myself to be among the 10 pylons to be winged by the Nigerian Air Force this afternoon. How, how was the training for you? Um, it was really intense, you know, coping with the fact that um, the, the, especially the challenges we had was the time frame for, for, for us to attain up to commercial pilot license. It was really intense and then we had to like sacrifice a lot for it. So how do you feel today that one of your sons has been uh, winged to the Nigerian Air Force? Well, I feel very excited and uh, pleased with his uh, progress so far and then uh, he's made us proud. So I just say more grace to his elbow and more <laughs> wings to his um, shoulders. How do you feel today that you have been winged? Uh, fulfilled. Uh, it's, it's just a beginning, so actually I'm not... Um, when I get to the top, I will know where to start from, actually. In a man's life, is not easy. From passing out, 
collect their uh, ranks, going to South Africa to learn. Some people go there, they can't even come back. So we go, what they taught them, they, they, they don't even understand anything. So we come back, crying, all those things. So, but by God's grace, the way they went, they want to say fully, they come back to say fully. So we thank God for their wings. And God should give them more likes. So they should, they should, they should aim the rank of generals. That's why we are thanking God.